So as you guys can tell by the title of the video, Hasim Rahman Jr. versus Greg Hardy is uh, official. They'll be fighting this coming weekend, this Saturday on the uh, 19th of November over in Austin, Texas, USA. Uh, to those who don't know yet, uh, Rahman was originally supposed to fight Vitor Belfort, but uh, Belfort uh, tested positive, not for steroids, <laughs> but he tested positive for uh, COVID. So um, he was not available and they found a last minute replacement in Greg Hardy. The event moves on, Misfits series number three um, on the zone, live on the zone. But the main event will now be the uh, Dean the Great versus Waleed Sharks fight. So, so yeah, a bunch of influencers and uh, 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 YouTubers fighting in this event. A lot of them, I have, I have no idea who they are, uh, but I'll, I'll look more into it. I'll make separate videos about these other fights. And um, yeah, honestly, I'm, I'm looking forward to the event. I'm actually looking forward to do, watching an entertaining event uh, for this this weekend uh, in Misfits series number three. Uh, Hasim Rahman Jr., to those who don't know who he is yet, uh, he's the son of Hasim Rahman, former world champion um, from the great state of Maryland. Uh, it's crazy because a lot of people didn't even know who Rotman Jr. is until Jake Paul tried to fight him, uh, which was kind of sad uh, because, like I said, he's the son of a former world champion. I guess the, the like real hardcore boxing fans knew who Rotman is, but a lot of the cash one fans didn't even know who he was until Jake Paul uh, was, was supposed to fight him. Um, and now he's you know, he's all over the place on social media. His social media pages uh, skyrocketed. More people follow him now. And, um, and now here he is fighting Greg Hardy, uh, coming off a loss against uh, 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 McKinsey Morrison. Uh, tough loss that was. Um, that was his first and only loss. And here he is trying to rebound against Greg Hardy, a 34-year-old fighter from Florida, born in Mississippi. 1-0 uh, as a pro. One win coming by way of a knockout TKO. Turned pro just last month against Michael Cook and knocked him out in two rounds. Um, Greg Hardy, honestly, I don't know who he is. I had to Google him, and it turns out he is also, or he was, an American uh, football player. He played in the NFL for six seasons uh, with the uh, Carolina Panthers. Interesting. Um, did not know that. Did not know that. <laughs> and he also has a uh, MMA record of uh, seven wins of and five losses. As a uh, MMA pro, he fought in the UFC a few times. Not just a few times, actually plenty of times. Uh, he's currently in a three-fight losing streak. Um, I guess the UFC dropped him. Uh, last fight was against Sergey Spivak back in uh, March of 2022 in the undercard of the Covington versus Masvidal fight. He got knocked out in the first round. So, so yeah, it should be entertaining. Um, I'll look more into him and I'll make my prediction video uh, soon. So, so yeah, let me know what you guys think about this fight. Uh, again, he's no longer the main event. This fight's no longer the main event. The main event will be uh, this fight between Dean the Great and uh, Waleed Sharks. Just FYI. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. And like always, have a great day. Alright, thanks.